happy Monday. Welcome to a new vlog. So we're just going to bring you guys along this week and we've got some fun things planned actually. We're going to meet Tom and Jazz tomorrow um, for an in-person meeting and then we've got a really big interview on Wednesday. <laughs> yeah, it's like we have this week a big company announcement and yeah. also personal situation going on which we're really excited to share more about. And then later this week we're filming an amazing penthouse in Canary Wharf. Oh it's yeah, that's on that's on Wednesday too after yeah. our interview. So around eight and a half million pounds this one but fully interior designed. Yeah. Like a renowned studio. Really so nice interior design. Excited for you guys to see the behind the scenes of that. Some of the other team will be there. Thank you very much. The project. Shout mm. out there, actually make very, very good salad. So this is one of our favourite places for healthy salads. Also Attis. Is yeah, a good one. that is good. Mine's goat cheesy, but this is the only non-spicy one they have. Okay, I forgot to show you yesterday. I got some bits from Reese, some smart workwear. So I'm gonna try them on and show you guys. Okay, so this is the first purchase, some pink trousers, paired it with a cute little vintage pink bag. Yeah, and then I also got this really nice belt. Next up are the white trousers. So we've got two pockets. I've added the belt for this one. Um, and then this is the top that I bought. It's actually a waistcoat, but let me show you what on. What are you laughing at, Matt? <laughs> no, I really like this outfit. <laughs> so this is the waistcoat on. It's got a little uh, thing at the back to snatch it in. Um, Not that it needs any snatching. <laughs> So this is my final haul, and then Matt actually got a pair of shoes. Yeah, because you like opening my parcels, don't you? <laughs> as we found out from the last vlog. Hello everyone, welcome to my fashion show. We just have one item today on Matt's haul, and it's a very simple pair of shoes, but I will show you, I think some people would like to know. So I just picked up like a smart shoe that's pretty straightforward. So is this for like, work yeah just day-to-day -day work smart um, from Reese also which is a pretty good brand we're finding a lot there that we like recently cool what are we doing yes so we've had a good day productive and we're making the most of these late night making the most of these late nights um, with a late, sun late Sunday nights late Sunday yeah nights, so. <laughs> so we had one meeting this afternoon with a like a brand and web development specialist yeah. talked about some really cool concepts for a new business that we're building at the moment within the luxury home industry so stay tuned for that then after that I had a meeting with the social media team at one of the UK's biggest house builders um, we actually yeah it's down there it's cute. yeah it's a nice new street isn't it oh look at this yeah so you had one, so yeah, yeah we had a meeting social media yeah. Yeah, yeah one of the top uk house builders and we worked with them around a month and a half ago on a project as they were releasing a new line a new product offering within their yeah. business and our partnership was very successful yeah to say the least it Absolutely. was very successful and typically this company invests a lot into oh, traditional yeah. media and uh pr strategy yeah there's a lot of i nice want to show them the houses too i'll carry on yeah they are like Houses. They actually look new built in there. Yeah. I like this one at the end. This I was doing a lot of research today. Let me show you this. I like this one. I won't show too much. Someone's house. So we helped them with the launch of this new product and it was the most successful like campaign they've done of this kind ever previously. And in comparison to what they traditionally allocate the budget to. Anyway, the summary of this is as we go into the next financial year, we could potentially be working with them on a much bigger scale on a number of new sites, um, which is exciting because that's what I've been trying to recommend we do with, with a number of developers. And you've got to remember what we're offering with the Luxury Home Show and what we're building here is still very new in a traditional industry, you know, real estate and house building and uh, really anything residential and commercial real estate in the UK. Is, it's pretty traditional, to be honest, and how things are marketed and with the brand that we built the luxury home show across the various channels and just our marketing strategy in general we're like getting really great results for and people are definitely starting to see that and we're getting more video testimonials and what we've known has so much potential for years and what we started when we were agents ourselves 
we implemented for us and it was highly successful for our own listings, we're now able to offer to more. One second, that's loud. So as I was saying, yeah, we're now able to offer that and other people are really interested to work with us. So now it's a case of we've got to be selective about the ones we do because every project we want to work on, we want to make sure it's successful. come for a walk to Fitzrovia. It's nice checking out all the buildings. It's just so nice after a long day of working at like 5 30 pm to come out and just go for wonder and admire the architecture. Oh yeah it's called trench as a teddy bear. <laughs> that is cute you can have a date. Maybe we can come to this one. Yeah it's actually a nice location looking out. What's this store? Garlic probably a cafe. Okay, for tonight's dinner, we've gone for crispy cheesy potatoes, broccoli, and two steaks. Nice and simple. That looks good. And also, Summer burnt her finger on the oven. I always burn myself. That's why you use the oven glove. Good morning. All right, it is Tuesday now, this week. And 7 a.m. Yeah, 7 a.m. We're about to drive two hours to meet Tom and Jazz, who are based in the Midlands at the moment. We're going to have a weekly catch up with them that we typically do over Zoom. But this week we want to meet in person because we have a cool company announcement. So they're going to be one of the first to know, of course. Um, <laughs> if you don't know, Tom's my brother, Jazz is his partner. They both work for the Luxury Home Show business and they were our first two people to join the business. So they've been there from pretty early on and they're doing amazing so far. And uh, you guys, I'm sure if you watch the Luxury Home Show, you'll have seen a lot of their content. Mm. So it's good to always meet up with them, of course, um, from a business perspective. Over avocado toast. Yeah, always great to see your brother too. So oh, that's sweet. To it. Yeah, it? so we've got a two-hour drive. It's a bit rainy today here in London, but it's what it is. So let's get popping. It's what it is. We've just come back to meet someone, Jazz, and we've dropped the car off actually at our balloting, and we're going to get that all fully clean because we are selling the car. So we want to get full like, pre-sale detail. And Rio is the guy to do that. Thank you. Yeah, nice new showroom. I love to see other business owners like moving to a new place and being successful. I like the lights. It's cool. Yeah. So just waiting for Tom to pick us up now. And we're going to head to a restaurant to have a breakfast meeting. Um, treat them to that. <laughs> Carry on with the day. Guys, look what I bought from Amazon. Because she don't have a bag for me. Now. Oh, you hook on there. Oh no, the table's too thin. <laughs> can't quite get it. This is wide angle, but I can't quite see. Can it come down? Oh, I like that. Yeah. yeah. Smart. So we've just parked at the restaurant where Tom and Jazz live. And they're coming in in a second. Hi, Tom and Jazz are here. What is that green drink? <laughs> What's your Custom drink? Matcha. That's cool, it's like inside the bar. Like a potion. What's the verdict? Mm, no, yes. that's the verdict. Okay. No, that is. Yeah, it's so I will nice. be able to We're heading back to London now. It's funny because the skies are blue in London. <laughs> so it's like we've drove down and it's got sunny at London. It's it's nice. warm it does feel warm. I do have my heated seat on, so that could also be fine. <laughs> Um, so we're 25 minutes away from the car park. It's great to see Tom and Jazz in person. We have a lot of meetings with them over Zoom, but you can't be in person. I just feel like yeah, it's, it's, so it's better, yeah. I think in a world now where everything is moving so digitally, yeah. like, I still really value in-person meetings, face-to-face -face contact. I love picking up the phone and having a conversation with people, especially in the business setting. Me too. So yeah. it's nearly 6 p.m. We're going to head back, have an early night tonight because our interview is the first thing tomorrow morning and need to just prep for that and just finalise some things. So we'll tell you more about that in the next video. We're going to be one of those annoying people that don't actually tell us who, what you're doing. No one will know what you mean when you say interview. Just a big interview. Oh my God, that's all we can say right now. It's not with a company, of course. Uh, so we'll probably pick up the camera 
tomorrow. So I'm ready for my interview. I'm giving corporate <laughs> off to my job. So wish me luck. So updates coming soon. Updates coming soon, and we'll pick the camera up afterwards because we will not be able to film anything. <laughs> got about a 40 minute drive and we'll let you know how it goes after and then we'll probably in the next video tell you what the interview was for. <sighs> All finished. Oh, wow. <laughs> It was good. Good moment, good milestone achieved. So now I'm getting green juice and we've got some banana bread too. What are you doing, Matt? Yeah, she's looking on the system. She's reviewing the footage now. Hi, Matt. Luxury show camera set up. Hello. <laughs> um, we just did the intro and talked through this area for the tour. Wow, this looks good. Reviewing it back and checking it out. Yeah, amazing apartment. How's it going, Tom? Yeah, looking good. Get some info. <laughs> There's a nice double height. Living space. Dining room. <laughs> I quickly show the kitchen. This has all been interior designed by Studio Ashby. And then we've got the view. We've got a massive terrace with this penthouse too. This is the main part. Wow. I love the sink. And that too. Then here's a look at one of the bedrooms on the ground floor. And I'll check that out for a bath with you. Wow. Got dual sinks. Solo vlogging. And a nice shower and toilet. Okay, we're just going to head down to the cinema room to film the amenities and have some lunch. Ready, Sha? Yes. <laughs> vlog, I'm vlog. Cool. Mm. Late summer, it's quite a little bit here if you need those. Thank you. Where are we now, Matt? We are on level seven. Uh, yeah, this is it. It's a level seven one crown place, the like, meeting area, hangout area. It's beautiful. Kitchen here. So, this is what you can use as a resident. You can hang out with your friends here. Something else? I didn't even know what it was. Okay. Excuses from Charles. Excuses from me. <laughs> um, summer? Um, like Henry something? Do you remember? No. It's keys in your name. Oh, late summer. That's, yeah, that's good. Feel of the TV. <laughs> nice. Now, what I want to know, what do you think? Because I think this TV is too small for this space. What does everyone think? Agreed. Yeah. And again, you do have a resident cinema. So you could just go watch Netflix and all cinemas yourself because that's not big enough. I've actually already took out the packaging because I was already so excited, but I got the cleansing oil. I've not tried this. I'm going to try this tonight. I got the, I'll just move that out of the camera, prep and prime fix it spray. This is really good. And the OG bronzer, give me sun. I've seen so many makeup artists talk about this product, so I really wanted to try it. I got two lip glosses. These look like highlighters. They're like a glossy gloss thing. I love it. I've already put it on my lips. And then lastly, I've got two lipsticks. This is in Velvet Teddy. 
I used to have that ages, ages ago. And this one is Thanks It's Mac and a lip liner in Spice. I love MAC lip liners and I actually don't have this uh, shade so I'm glad to add this one to my collection. But yeah, I just wanted to do that little unboxing because I do love I do love an unboxing. If there's a parcel that's been arrived, I'm so excited to open, <laughs> open it. And yes, actually this is a new top from Cook Eye. What does everyone think? <laughs> Matt's looking at me over there. Shall we say bye to the vlog? We shall say bye. So, Next vlog is the announcement that you've all been waiting for. Mm -hmm. So stay tuned. I've been waiting for. Has anybody been waiting oh, for? I've been it? waiting for it. <laughs> Yeah, we're, the announcement we were talking about earlier, we'll, we'll mention it in the next vlog. So we won't keep you um, hanging too long on that. And see you soon. <laughs> Bye.